What's up, gamers? This is Steph, PlayStation Gamer, quickly talking to you guys today about Redfall and Starfield being delayed into next year. Um, this sucks, if I'm being straightforward, because this means there's been no major first-party game released from Microsoft in a whole year. Now, do I think that showcase thing they're going to do is going to fix that? I have doubts about that, because it feels like Literally, they're, they're like it's a month away, this showcase, and they announced something like this. It feels like that's Microsoft kind of trying to tell people, temper your expectations, which um, that's never good when someone tells you to temper your expectations, just like you know, a few other companies have done in the past. But I just never seen this, where a company has not at least put out one freaking game in a whole year. You know, in an age where... You know, you think Microsoft has all the money. They can literally, they have all the money they could want. They could have, they have the best, you know, some of the best studios in the world. And yet, they still can't get a game out. What is going on with these studios? Now, obviously, I think this is mostly to do with quality control. They're trying to make sure the game runs at a stable frame rate and resolution and all that stuff. But no one possesses this track record, though. That's also kind of a cause for concern if I'm being straightforward. But I just, I'm kind of shocked by this. Just because, like, this was their one game. Like, Starfield was their one big game everyone was super hyped about. And now it's just like, oh, yeah, it's just not happening this year. It'll happen next year, but it's not happening this year. And Redfall, it's whatever. It looks like a game that might be okay, but... I mean, I don't think we really saw real gameplay for it in that trailer, at least the one you'll see. But yeah, this is kind of the problem when you have your entire year right on one game, or I guess in this case, two games, and you don't spread it, you don't put anything out for the rest of the year. I feel like that's kind of the problem with Microsoft. It's like, hey, we don't have a lot of big games this year, but we'll have that one big one towards the end because that's when everyone puts out their games and we're just going to follow the trends like everyone else does. Instead of, you know, being like Sony where you try to spread them out through the year instead of, you know, just rushing it all towards the end. But that's my opinion on this whole situation. What do you guys think? Do you think this hurts Xbox? Do you think this is nothing? Do you think I'm just being a little petty PlayStation fanboy that's trying to get a little W? Or do you think I'm being valid with my criticisms? Until next time, guys, this is that PlayStation Gamer. Make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to use, do all that YouTube algorithm BS. Also, quick announcement. This Saturday, I'll be doing a live stream for Demon Souls uh, Remake because we hit over 100 subscribers. Thank you guys for that. It was really cool to see that actually happen. Right as I was actually on a stream with uh, Therapy, if you guys know who I'm talking about, um, check him out. I was actually in his live stream. Pretty cool dude. Nice uh, time to hang out, just talk to him and just rice. Until next time, guys, this is Steph, PlayStation Gamer. Sign out. You'll all have a good day now. Peace.